There's nothing like chilling with my girls. Just me and my divas taking over the world. What's up, what's up, Diva? So it's time for a new synthetic lace front wig. This one is available at ElevateStyles.com. So this is by the company called Wig Factory, and this one is called Joy. Um, the color that I have is a 99J, but honestly, this is the color. Like, there's nothing wrong with your monitor. This is the actual color of the unit. So it does come with combs in it as normal, an adjustable strap, and the part is actually on the right side. It's a curved right part. But... Yeah, like, it really doesn't look like a 99J at all, which is, you know, burgundy. So, I don't know. I'm still going to go with it and try it out. So, I did take some of my pressed powder and rub it on the inside of the actual lace frontal part, part just to give it, like, a natural scalp look. And, you know, that little band that you see me rocking is actually my wig grip band. I did like it somewhat. Um, I did tell you guys that I had to actually stretch it out, or actually it stretched out, and I had to re-sew it. So, you know, um, hey, it is what it is. But, yeah, as for the wig, um, I'm not really sure how I'm feeling about the wig. For one, I really did want to try it in a 99J just because of the color. Um, but I like the curl pattern, but I'm not really sure about the wig. You know what I'm saying? Like, not really sure. I think if it was a little bit more even, the layering, I would probably like it more. Definitely not really sure about it. But, I mean, to each his own, everybody has a preference to, for something for me, maybe not for you. Something for you may not be for me, so maybe somebody else likes it. So, as you guys see, I always go ahead and take a little bit of my front, front perimeter hairline out, and I'm going to use some of this Boldify, which is the same thing as Topic Hair Filler Fibers. So, this is good if you're trying to blend in your wig, if you have thin edges, if you have balding spots. You know, guys, I always talk about it, so definitely check them out. You get twice the product for half the price, and it's called Boldify. Hopefully I remember to put the link in the video. So I did need a little bit more concealer just to give it a more natural look. So I did apply a little bit more and I'm just fluffing this out to see how it would look. I'm trying to get the look that the girl actually represented on the website, but you know, hey, maybe she has a smaller head. But yeah, like I was saying, I'm not really sure how I feel about it. So I'm just going to go ahead and play around with it. It kind of gives me like an early 90s vibe. So I'm just going to try to tame the hair. I'm using some of the lot of body wrap mousse. To me, it's all the same wrap mousse, styling mousse, you know, mousse is mousse. It foams up, you get like a whipped creamy kind of like texture and it all kind of works the same. So yeah, I'm just using this to kind of like style the wig and get it a little bit more uniformed and tamed. You know, I'm trying my best, girls, okay? But so here's the kicker. Like I said, I really didn't like the long lengths in it. So I went ahead and took a bobby pin and kind of like tucked it in and pinned it up so that way the hair will kind of like flow all together and give me more or less like, you know, a more uniform look instead of like those two weird looking pieces like just hanging down right there. They were just kind of like hanging down. Um, so I did leave the one side down a little bit. I kind of went for a high-low color. So I feel like this is a little bit more for me. It just reminds me of something back in the early, early 90s, salt and pepper type of style. You know what I'm saying? This looks like something salt wore. But anyway, here's the back. Check out ElevateStyles.com for this unit. This is by Wig Factory. And for the most part, she's decent if you like something short like this. So I love you guys. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you guys in a soon-to-come video. Bye.